coming from from southeast Ohio, it's it's a very very impoverished area, and the 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 poverty rate is almost two times the the national average, and there's so many people there that that don't have a lot, and I'm up here for all those all those kids in Athens and in Athens County that you know go home to not a lot of food on the table, hungry after school. And you guys can be up here too. I'd like to thank. And that has led to the Joe Burrow effect away from the field, including restaurants in the Plains, Ohio, naming meals and omelets after him. Look at him celebrating with the fans after they came back after that win over Alabama and then changing his jersey name to Burrow in classic Louisiana style. He was in every way the Lion King as he won that Heisman Trophy in a landslide and over $500,000 raised to the Athens Food Pantry. Even got a giraffe named after him. He put up a sign in Baton Rouge this week thanking them for everything they've done. And of course, self-deflecting as well, basically monitoring and saying, I haven't gotten a haircut in a month, so don't make fun of me. I couldn't get to the barber and get cleaned up. But ladies and gentlemen, the pick is in. The Bengals have turned in their selection. Let us go to the commissioner. Okay, here we go. With the first pick in the 2020 draft, the Cincinnati Bengals select Joe Burrow, quarterback, LSU. And there you see Joe with mom and dad, and you have to wonder what's going through his mind right now. Remember, when he entered the transfer portal, he said one more time he wanted to go to Nebraska, and Scott Frost, the coach, said, is he better than what we got? Uh, the answer is yes. Mel Kuyper, what do you like most?